open up for you guys, so... And anyway, welcome back everyone to our The Summit 5 China uh, group stage. The, the game between remaining. Team New Be Young versus Team E Home in best of 3 series. Five and this is game number 2, guys. The current score is E Home 1. Oh, I'm sorry, E Home 0, New Be Young 1. You're here with me, Cyclops, as your caster. That was very bad first game for e home to be honest you know i'm not sure what happened they did trying to to experiment do some experiment or something with the heroes i'm not sure about that but it seems like a newbie young first man doom and lion from e home you know doom and lion is the most picked and banned heroes in china scene at the moment and now i think i'm pretty sure the e home will pick something like enchantress or a chen this game for ice ice eye and maybe uh maybe move the old man lamb into to, oh enchantress ban move old man lamb to play off laner so it could be a chain by e home if newbie young did you know steal it from e home now first pick from e home what's it gonna be beast master still in the pool it might be a beast Ten seconds beast off lane hunter. oh bounty hunter Dire Gonna be Bounty Hunter by Ice Ice Eye instead of some disruptor. jungler. Gyrocopter Disruptor for newbie, yeah. Turn to pick. Say hi to all Ten the guys in the chat room. Remain. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I also gotta apologize about the Five mistake. Um, just in the first game, Reserve about time. the mic and thing, uh, it should all be fixed. Say hi to LD. You know, I I have been watching all the hubs uh, of Beyond the Summit during during the Manila Major, and and I think it's actually their best show so far. Yeah, congratulations, man. The hub was great. I really enjoy it. Now. Uh, New be young in gyrocopter and disrupt the bounty hunter first pick from e home. Let's take a look at some fact about team e home. Where is my note? Invoker Dire Team Bad to deal with e home. Like I told you since the last game, E Home was a team that they have jungler specialists in their team, e which is which is I I I, and they always play early uh, early game aggressive, very aggressive against the off laner of the other team. But but if what happened last game is, I Hunter solo killed that hard carry and also support, <laughs> so that was a big mistake of E Home last game. Uh, so this game, I think newbie young hard carry, especially when you pick a gyrocopter as a hard carry. I think gyrocopter need to carry a TP. When when E home trying to do some smoke gang and trying to wrap up their their off laner of newbie young, gyrocopter need to TP down and use his rocket barrage or even a call down to to counter the gang. Uh, I think that that would be a very uh, effective strategy for newbie young this game. Phoenix, I'm not sure is it going to be an off lane Phoenix or maybe a support. It could be anything. In Walker Mid by Old Chicken. One of the best in Walker in China remaining. for Old Chicken. Five seconds remaining. Had a surprise with, with newbie young performance in, in first Reserve game. Time. They play so good, man. All the timing, all all the farming, laning phase, all perfect. Faceless war. Faceless war as an off laner. Dire team pick. Ten seconds. Well, in six point eight, six point eight seven C, uh, Barty Hunter got remaining. nerfed about his Dinata. It, it, it used to have more slow than this, like 18% I think, but now it dropped to around like 15%, 20, 
Yeah, they want to nerf this hero, body hunter. I'm, I'm, but I believe that the track is still the same. Track gold and thing. That's the most important thing of, of body hunter. You guys remember back then in, in like 6.84 or something that track he gives some vision to? to Man, that was so... That was so OP. Alchemist for newbie y young. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Forward pick from E home. What's it Reserve gonna be? Time. They seem like they still need uh, position five support. Um, disruptor was picked. Engine perishing. Not bad. I kind of worry about e home that they are lack of uh, visible spells, like uh, reli reliable stunners. Ancient apparition can 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 slow the target, ah. and, and also his cold field can stun, but e not so reliable. Red King Bandit, that is quite interesting ban from newbie young. That that must be some respect ban, like. Like they used to scream with E home, some secret heroes of E home because it's it's not ordinary Ten band for sure. Remaining. Five seconds remaining. I I I Bounty Hunter. Let's see how good his BH is. Ten seconds Remain. Right. E Holmes turn to pick. Root Mother Bandit, E Home. Last hero. A carry. What do we have in the pool? How about something like Ten Phantom Sassin? You know, Phantom Sassin got a little buff in 6.87C. His dagger. More damage in, in, in level 1, it's gonna be easier for him to last hit or Reserve even try to harass the, the opponent. Five Spectre, Phantom Sassin. Slada. Slada? Dire team pick. Now e home looking to play very aggressive, this one. You know, they got two tracks from Body Hunter and Slada. No real hard carry. They're gonna lose in late game if they're gonna finish the game within like 35 or 40 minutes. They're definitely gonna lose the late game. Now, picking like this, E Home knows that they're playing Five against the time bomb. Remaining. Alchemist and Gyrocopter is no joke in late game. Now, newbie Reserve Yang time. need to pick a hero that, that can. Clockwork. Oh, clockwork. As an offlane, it's, it's gonna be a Phoenix and Disruptor as a sport. All right, we are going in. Ten seconds remaining. All right, boys, we are in the game. Gonna do some quick intro here. Who play who in this game for E Home? Um, switch back to a radiant side. Oh, eleven. On Slada, Old Man Lamb, on Body Hunter, Fenrir, on Ancient Apparition, Ice Eye Psych, on Faces Void, Old Chicken, on Invoker, on Newbie Young, in a Dire Side, S Triple C, on Alchemist, M Triple R, on Disruptor, Jetia, on Gyrocopter, Lay, on Phoenix, and two Lay. So they, they, they got two Lay in this team. One is Lay, and another one is two Lay. Uh, on Clockwork. That's quite weird, but let's take a look at this one first. E home 011 almost ran into the whole party of Newbie Yang right here. Five heroes of Newbie Yang just came here to play some wards, and it is going to leave. Thirty seconds to battle. 
Old Man Lamb facing Observer Ward here to block the creep cam and maybe give a little vision over there. Super C just picked up the body rune. Um, I think the reason that they picked Slada last pick for Team E Home is they wanna use this Slada to kill alchemists like, like. Five or seven kills, you know, just blinking, amplify damage, very easy kill an alchemist. Old man lamb coming in, trying to harass. It was not meant. So in the middle lane is battle between Invoker by Old Chicken versus H Trouble C Al Alchemist, top lane, solo lane, ice ice ice. The face on faces void was a skyrocopter and disruptor. Bottom lane is a solo lane clockwork by two lane against tri lane from E home body hunter. Uh, ancient apparition in Salada. Uh -uh. It would be quite hard to kill this faces void on top. Anything happens, it's just gonna come walk away. It would be fine. Side side side. Lada leading on the last hit with 7 2 deny. Old chicken. Kinda hard for old chicken to stay in this lane against that acid gas from the alchemist. Gonna spam it. Once he got the bottle, it's gonna be even worse for it. For old chicken. Nice shooting. It's called the, the sun ray. I always call it sunbeam or something. Oh man, lamb. Just roaming around. I don't think he can kill anyone in, in this such early game with his level 1. Now he's level 2. But the fact that Jinada got nerfed is going to be a little harder for Barbie Hunter to gank. Look at this one. Going straight for N Triple R, slow him down. N Triple R, nice using the Sun Ray, trying to heal up the support, but they got him. Oh man, Lamb, is he gonna survive? No, but he. Sentry Wars was there. Now they lost a the kill to that guy, Rocopter, but they got the first blood first. Mm, actually, not a good kill for it. Not a good trade for E Home, though. First blood these days is actually nothing. The fact that he he beat himself to a gyrocopter is actually not good for E home at all. Lucky newbie, they got a sentry ward here, or the body hunters just get away. Got away, I mean. Play. One lay, I I I going a little bit too cocky on the support. He's trying to walk away, uh, but he was slowed down by Sandre. M Triple R. Now he just got glimpse. He can use it. But meanwhile, in the middle lane and bottom lane, got another kill. But we just gonna focus on this one first. I I I already popped this up. He trying to jump into the tree line. He already bought some TP, but he died first because of the rocket barrage. Clockwork was down. Bottom lane as well. As people see, 
Man, three man gank on S triple C. Still not level six yet. He's just gonna die right there. I didn't come here. Four to two. Four to two game score. Talking about four to two, I just gonna uh, congratulations to all the Leicester fan out there. They 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 officially won the Premier League. That is what a wonderful season for Leicester City. You know, some small team bottom tower is under attack. with no big name players <laughs> can actually win the Premier League, that the hardest league in the world. Congratulations. Now back to the game guys, 5 minutes time, I'm gonna show you guys the network, leading by a Gyrocopter. Dear Gia got 2 kills already, he just got he got his base boot on his way to Ring of Aquila I guess. He might doing some dual aura, like Ring of Aquila and a drum. I side, side, side. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Did a ring up health. What's he gonna do with that ring up health, by the way? If he's going for a, a battle theory? Or how about Vanguard? <laughs> you know, Vanguard is actually not bad in, in this 6.87 because he's got buffs, man. Vanguard is a lot better. And Vanguard is also an ingredient to go for Abyssal Blade. Imagine if, if this face and walk actually. By a vanguard, he will be very tanky. But we look at the fight here first. Clockwork. A trade between Clockwork and a hard carry. Pretty good trade for Team Newbie, to be honest. They got Slada. They're gonna they, they're gonna slow down the Slada farming. Oh, chicken. Bring up Aquila Toe Chicken. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Oh man, Lamb drop a sentry. Trying to kill the sentry right here. Gonna kill the sentry first. Gonna be Old Man Lamb. Oh who? Oh! All sentry falls. Alchemy just got his soul ring. He's just gonna keep spamming his Aces spray. Get Radiance ASAP. It kills already. I'm gonna show you guys some graph. E home still slightly ahead in terms of boulder and experience, but it uh, seems like the graph is dropping down to new beyond side. Not a good news for E home. Oh, the first chronosphere sphere of the game. Team up with a sun try. Can they kill Tia 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 Tia? Dropping a call down. Also, rocket barrage. He died before finish the two target. Almost a double kill for Tia Tia. But what I, I, I didn't know is Alchemist coming in. One more hit, maybe two more hits away from the Ice Ice Eye. Yes, it was he just gave up first. Like S triple C oh C tools. I missed the action over there, but at least I'm gonna show you guys some fight recap to see what happened. Team Lada team up with Ancient Apparition Do some skills to kill that Clockwork Clockwork died for 3 times already He got 1 kill He got dive in, hit that O11 Dear dear right here, he got base boot He can run through that creep Dive with the Sun Ray Sun Ray by Newbie Lay Hi there Old oh, man lamb. Walk past the sentry ward. Sun strike hit. Very nice combination between a sun strike and Shuriken. Shuriken level 3, but lamb in big trouble right there. This is gonna be fine. A nice hook game for the Dutch. What a play by two legs. Two lay. No more hoops, but he can just dive in with a barely assault. Level 3, dropping a call down. Dear dear, call down didn't hit. But, um, O11 coming out uh, from the tower. Oh! Man, look at that! Benry! TP down, trying to help his teammates, but actually they're all gonna fall. But nope! 
It's actually a pretty good trade for E Home. They got the, the off lane of Team New Yang. They got the clock well, but they only lost uh, the support. Uh, Ancient Persian. Top lane ice. Infused raindrop. Alchemy is 1.7k gold, we're pretty sure that he's just gonna go for it. Not sure is he gonna go for an armored modigen or just straight to, to a radiance. If he going straight to a radiance, he's gonna boost his financial after he get it. With this rate of farming, he should get radiance around like 16 minutes. 17 if he dies. Faces Y on top, power triad, ring of regeneration. Dyer's top tower is under attack. First half smoke by E home, trying to catch someone top. It's M triple R, staying in a tree line. Another smoke coming out from Newbie Yang as well, aiming for the O11. O11 just got his bling dagger, sending in a missile. Dyer's to see top where is he? It's all O11. Are they gonna hook in? They're gonna wait this GG and push the creep wave in first. Once the creep wave Dyer's hits the tower, that's when Clockwork hook in. He'll be late, luckily. Bottom tower is under that attack. ice lot didn't connect. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower has fallen. Radiant structures are fortified. Party Hunter just got that alchemist and it's a track kill as well. Very big kill. The GG gonna get caught. Very greedy. He just won the power. He just won the, the last hit for the tower. It's not worth it at all. The too late, however, finish that Bounty Hunter. But he might go out because I, I, I jumping on him, trying to bash him. He still can He can use his Chrono Fear. Very nice, perfect timing. Get a few static storm huh? by the disruptor. Coming in with Sunray, got another kill once ladder. Woo! This Phoenix is just like a Cyclops or something. Man, keep shooting the ray on people like that. Look at that, Fenrir saw him. He's trying to run away from the Phoenix, but why lay? He knows that Fenrir is not so far away. Now, here we go, the Cyclops coming out once again. Shoot him with the Sunray. Fenrir trying to walk away. He's gonna go down. Actually, almost a double kill by Y lay. He still got, can equal die the way, but he died because of the Sun Strike. I kind of like Invoker Sunstrike in this game, to be honest. Very accurate. Accurate. Like, he, he hit like 90% Sunstrike in this game for old chicken. Clockwork, uh, big team smoke once again. I kind of surprised that newbie didn't even let that <laughs> that alchemy is doing some farm. Alchemy is actually ganking with them, and this alchemy didn't even go for a, a radius. That here we go. Oh, 11. You wanna gank me? You wanna gank my alchemy? My alchemy is a ganker right there. Too late. Goes down. No, um, no shadow blade cooldown for H triple C. Some fight going on here as well. M Triple R trying to set up Kendrick Phil Static Storm and himself on TP away, but he was stopped by Ice Ice Eye Colonel Sphere. Died. I kind of surprised that this game is actually you know action packed, unlike any other Chinese game. Like they they, they keep roaming in on each other. Dear dear, dear dear, hit by an ice blast. And also Sunstrike at the same time. In Wolf it got him. Old Chicken killing three, sorry. Old Chicken with the power trio, a hand of us, a dual aura. I kinda of surprised that Invoker went for a dual aura right there. Blinking, Glittering, Crutch, Amplify damage, easy kill, H triple C. Palace play by the Alchemist.
16 to 11. Well, Phoenix these day, Max Sunray, I, be, I believe back then, like in a year ago, they, they didn't max it. They only add it for like one level and, and, and they max Secret Dive or Fire Spirits or something. I remember in Dota 1, when, when Phoenix just got added into, into Dota, people playing like so mad, man. I'm, I'm so... I... So much hate on this hero. We call it a haunted bird or something. Keep shooting Ray on us. I'm not think much we can do, la. You know, we die in a Ray. Smoke up. Four heroes blinking. Little crutch static storm, easy kill on the clockwork. No opener for team newbie young. They need to retreat. A trap on wide people are walking into the high ground, but it's triple C trying to come in. Astana, oh 11. Oh man, why people are trying to come back and dropping some skill and he dies without using any skill anyway. Oh 11 running away. They know they're gonna chase Slada. But now look at this one first. Dear dear. Cold feet stun him. And while they also come back with full HP, boom, and caught a fear by the night. I saw what a fear by the night. Wow! That is the first team wipe in this one. And he actually went for a went guard, I told you. I called it. Man, faces wipe with a went guard. I knew it. You know, Vanguard is actually my favorite item in the game, but every time back then in like 6.85, 6.84, when I when I say about Vanguard, people go me like, what are you talking about? Go home, 2K Castle, who's gonna go for Vanguard in, in the competitive scene? I kind of agree with them because Vanguard back then is very useless um, item, nobody buy it. <laughs> but yeah, finally, my dream come true. Someone bought Vanguard in competitive scene, especially in Outer Summit 5 tournament, a very big tournament. Told ya. <laughs> very happy about that. Anyway, it's 17 minutes time, gonna show you guys some items update. Actually, this Ice Ice Side didn't even go for Vanguard only, he went for Blade Mail too. What a tanky faces what we have here. E-Home and other smoke coming out. Take a look at the graph. E-Home was so far ahead after that team wipe. Newbie Young, I think they, they need to figure out this game that they are much, much better in, in late game. They, they might have to stay away from the team fight instead of going in every time like that because E-Home got Ice Ice Ivy and Chrono Sphere is very dangerous if they got Chrono like that again. Pretty much a game for team Newbie Young. Now that's what I'm talking about. Ice Eye coming out and it's an air ball by Ice Ice Eye. That's not good at all. Now blinking in all 11 mana than with the Anonymous mistake as well. So that Kendrick Field takes off but cleans him out of Kendrick Field. I don't understand that. But however, there's been many to get the slider down. Coming in here, here, here for the tier. Everyone over there with a rocket barrage. Oh my goodness. Alchemy is also here. Two in Sunray. Attack on Phoenix. But that's not gonna help. Ice Eye is still kind of healthy though. He got oh another hook on Old Man Lamb. BD Lamb in big trouble over there, BD! Oh my goodness! And they got the Bounty Hunter 2 down for E-Home! They saw the light at the end of the, at the tunnel of 14 Newbie Young! Got 2 kills over there, very important for the whole game! Right back, right away from Milby. And after that team fight, the, the graph is going down a little bit. Ooh. All right. Oh, 11. Nothing much, man. I mean, I mean, you, you pick this hero as your hard carry Slada. He's supposed to got more items by now. It's almost 20 minutes. I think this Slada should have armlet. Of Modesian, a uh, power triad and a blink dagger. Not only power triad and a blink dagger and and a mango.
Now E home trying to push in. That's gonna be the third tower in the game, the bottom tier one tower. Here we go, they're just gonna push more, trying to take down the bottom tier 2 towers. Five people on Team E home side, it's been blinking to the three shots, aiming for the clock work. Very nice aim, now no opener already for Team Newby Young. Hard carry also fall down, that's not good. Down to only three heroes, seems like Newby Young need to abandon this tower. 2.1k XP change in 1.3k gold change. Radiance middle tower is under attack. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's bottom tower has fallen. Radiance middle tower is under attack. And a catch on Wiley. Between Crutch in Sunstrike. Monster kill. It seems like Alchemist just got his Black King by. Is that gonna help? Of course not. You know, help against the. Uh, uh, help against the Sentinel Crutch. And, and also. Uh, amplify, uh, amplify damage. Not. Maybe all the spell from Alchemist and Invoker. Like I told you guys, I think E home got around like 20 minutes more before they start losing the game. This is 21 minutes. E home is so far ahead. If, if you take a look at the graph, more than 10k and 7.5k. Now E home marching in, trying to take down the mid tier to tower. That's nothing much newbie young can do because E home is carrying an Aegis on Slada. Slada gonna blink in first, and Aegis and start it off. With, oh, what a nice opener on the opener. Ice, 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 first one to go down, seems like Eho needs to retreat, get back here, they say glimpse back, Slada in the middle of the fight uh, and using the Phoenix Sun from the BKB, try to chop down the old man lamb, stuck in chaotic field, static storm, static storm already been used, shooting by the sun ray and ice blast, Phoenix, uh, Bounty Hunter goes down, Tornado trying to stop him, Newby Young from marching forward by old chicken, setting up an ice wall, Putting down the EMP, setting storm. Oh my goodness, can they build? He's right here. All 11, still got an Aegis. He's gonna come back full XP, full mana. And now it's time for Team Newbie Yang to retreat. They can't fight Slada just like that. Low mana, M Triple R. Now Slada chasing for an Alchemist. Alright, they put the Amplified Damage on him. All out with the um, Amplified Damage and Slytherin Crutch Sunstrike killing him. Alchemist falls out in the end. However, they managed to get rid of that Aegis in Slada. Seems like a one fight by Team Newbie Yang. Slightly better in terms of XP and change. In 26 to 17 game score. A lot of two points. And oh, coming back in the game. It's Old Man 11. What? He seems to be mad on everything in this world, uh, like every time that he see people, he's just gonna jump in like a madman. This is how you play Slada, boys. If you wanna play Slada, don't play like a Southeast Asian Slada. You know, every time I play in MMR games, right? We all die, uh, like, mad, man, but our Slada still keep farming. Not sure what happened over there. Anyway, anything happened in Southeast Asia server. Now I think in this point of the game, the team that engaged first is gonna win the team fight. Absolutely. Now it's all about this clockwork and, and Slada. And also Faces Void. The fact that E-Home got two openers is gonna give them slightly advantage. While new newbie young need to, you know, Put their hope on clockwork, gonna be hard for two lay. He's the only opener in this game, and now he pour, open another guy to lock down that Fenrir in power cost, but he was skims away that setting up Kethic Field. A very nice kill by Team Newby Yang. It's not over yet, setting up Kethic Field, Static Storm once again, trying to throw out the two lay, trying to walk back to the high ground. You see, he's gonna go down. Yes, of course, and he's a track killer. 
Very nice, uh, just in time, old man lamb to trap on him. Got some go over there. Ice, 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 with an echo saber, and two tanky, um, two tanky vanguard. You know, the idea of this basic boy is he's not focused on his damage, all he needs to do is just stay at lo as, much, as long as possible in team fight, and trying to bash anyone in front of him with, um, with a double attack from echo saber. Look at that. He didn't even need an Agony Scepter uh, If he's aiming on the back That's why he didn't even max his time delay later Play Was tracked by Bounty Hunter Sun Strike coming out and we can cannot finish the target. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys some go and per mi uh go per minute chart right here while I'm sipping the water. Take a look who is the fastest farmer in this game. Lada finally got his BKB. Now it's gonna be much much better for him when he engage. You know, just blinking, uh, delivering crutch of the BKB, and he's, he he will be able to to come out of of the circle of the fight. However, Alchemist also got a, a BKB, and now nice, I can charge BKB and Silver Edge. Newbie just do some scan over here. Nobody. You home still got scan. I gotta inform you guys that after after this best of three series, we still have LGD versus VG. Next one, it's gonna be an awesome match for sure, guys. You know. LGD direct invited to Manila Major, but but that last match they, they they lost against a team they lost versus newbie like two two zero. Their form isn't that good, you know. But um, however, you know their 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 team name is very big. They are powerhouse in China. That's why they get a direct hit right there. But take a look at this one first. Nice ball start away. Now from the BKB. Melted down. The face is wide. Uh, he didn't even use his corner fear. He waited too long over there. Now shooting the head. Everyone shooting. Right clicking. And he landed. Oh man. Just one last second killing the head. Double kill by the old chicken. Old chicken is shooting. And will pop up his BKB as well. Uh, this guy is such a monster. All chicken over there. And that's it, S triple C go down, triple kill for the old chicken. This chicken is good chicken. Oh my dear dear, gonna be the next one. A fourth kill of course. Ultra kill for the old chicken. What a play, team wipe newbie Yang. 32 to 19 and here's the fight recap. Very good chance for team E home. Old chicken uh, boot up travel down to the bottom lane trying to take down the bottom tier 3 tower. And they will definitely get the rack right here. That's the rack, guys. Oh, nice token. Catching old chicken in power cost. That's gonna be a kill. In Walker, Beyond God Light's Rig broken. 1.4k go earned to that Phoenix. Enough gold for a 4 star A bit too greedy, you know, he, he should have died just now that, That's a lot of gold However, e home still so far ahead, more than 15k ahead
Hey, hi to all the guys in the chat room. Thank you so much for tuning in. And feel free to to support our the Summit Five tournament. Uh, we will have our our tickets up to the store in like maybe a week, I think. Feel free, you know. We we will have a wonderful bundles as usual. And buying a ticket will support our tournament, so we can keep going for the Summit Six, Seven, maybe the Summit Fifty or something. You know. Thank you so much, everyone. You know. Um, Gonna do a little sail out right here. X triple C, Alchemist, a BKB, and um, Maelstrom. Here we go. That be that first time BKB from Invoker is killing everyone in Team Newbie. Nobody cares about old chicken at all. They all just want to go for something like a support and thing. Like I remember old chicken standing right here, popping BKB and just shooting everyone left, top and bottom. Right. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm what busy writing something. And Slada just got a kill on the clockwork. Now Newbie Young down to only four heroes. That's not good. E home. Now they secure the area, ready to take down the Roshan. This is gonna get this Roshan and try to do the, the high ground. All chicken. The fact that I, I really like Body Hunter this game for Team E Home. Actually, if, if you take a look at the stats of Team E Home, you see that they, they didn't pick this hero much in in the in their past like five or six matches. They always go for something like Enchantress and Chen. If you take a look, and yep, they picked this one, and Old Man Lamb is playing it perfectly in the second game of the series. Every like 80% kill from Team E Home is a crack kill, and that gave them a lot of gold. Seems like A Triple C and M Triple are trying to do some camping right here. All right. Let's take a look at this one. Ready for the high ground, guys. Before the team fight start, I want you to hold your breath. Here we go, boys. Aegis with Slada as usual. Slada blink in and catch that two leg. Catch the openers again, but nice using four stop out. But GG is stuck in the corner. GG is gonna go down. Gonna show you guys some buyback stations right there. They lost a the gyrocopter, but gyrocopter bought back right away. Look at that old chicken shooting everyone just like his own base. This is the dire base. Old chicken, are you confused or something? He's standing on the high ground, uh, shooting newbie young player on the low ground. Uh, and now he's walking to the low ground, uh, shooting a newbie young player on the high ground. Uh, man, nobody can stop that invoker. A lot of damage coming out of him. But it seems like newbie young get rid of that Aegis already. But however, old chicken still leave the sunshine to kill one. What an invoker. Like I told you guys, an old chicken is one of the um, one of the best um, in Walker in the mainland. So no surprise, man. I I I jumped in. Combination that combination also pain in the in the back door. I mean, I mean, you know, because it it stopped the cool down. It's gonna be very hard for newbie down to land any single skill. So. Now Grim's in back but covered the BKB for the old chicken. Uh, Barak has been destroyed and Gia Gia bought back and died back. 38 to 20 GT call out from two lay. E home took the second game. Face destroyed. What a play between E home. And yep, we're gonna take a break for a few minutes, guys. I'm gonna show you guys some ads.
and then you know we'll be back to the third game of the series. It's gonna be an awesome third game for sure. Don't go anywhere. Thank you.